Thanks for joining us in Geneva for the AI for Good Global Summit 2019. And I am delighted to be joined by the Chief Executive Officer of Roland Berger, the Global Consultancy. Charles-Edouard Bouet, thank you so much for joining us. Good morning. Yes. And it's your first time at the summit, isn't it? So exactly. why did you feel it was important to attend? I think it's important because the uh, United Nations, together with some other people, are gathering a momentum around the SDG and putting AI for good as part of this momentum. That's why we wanted to be there. Okay. And of course, it's a global platform, isn't it, to discuss with other stakeholders the implications of AI. It's a very interesting platform because you have people from the government, you have people from the business, you have uh, sci-fi writers, you have entrepreneurs, you have tech people. So it's a good time to gather. It's a long, it's four days, it's fulfilled and very interesting. Is there a session in particular you'd like to attend? I think I try to get to a few sessions that uh, uh, have been organized. There's something about uh, ethics, there's something about uh, healthcare. So it's very, very rich. And I may not be able to attend all of this. Um, Obviously here we're trying to discuss the, the practical applications of ensuring that the uh, development of AI is safe and ethical. Um, so how do you think we can do that? What would you like the outcomes to be? I think it's very important that people understand that uh, what I call the three E's. AI will be everything for everyone, everywhere. And I think that's what people need to understand. I think this is why the international are getting involved. This is going to impact our lives in the next 10 and beyond, 10 years and beyond. And it's very important we understand the mechanism, everything which is linked to data, and all the implications. Because if it's everything, everywhere, for everyone, it will change our lives. And this is the United Nations. This is why AI for Good is very important. And what do you think is the most promising way in which AI can help, uh, can help deliver the UN SDGs? Is it in education, healthcare, smart cities? I think, as I said, it's going to be everything. But when we look at the short term, uh, the evolution we are seeing is on healthcare, on education, on the uh, efficiency of cities, we will see the first results. But what is much bigger for our perspective at Roland Berger is the emergence, and I will talk about it in my panel, what we call portable AI, which is your ability to control your life using artificial intelligence to become a human augmented intelligence. And in this context, it will allow all of us to live a better life. And that's, I think, what AI for Good and United Nations is pushing for. And when you advise corporates and they ask you for guidance um, as to how to use AI, what do they describe as their main challenges or concerns? Corporates now are just scratching the surface. I think the AI is uh, now in all the uh, annual reports, in all the calls with analysts, but it's not yet a reality. And I think this is where we see the, the gap. I think, think about internet, when people were talking about internet websites and they were not really using internet. And this is where we are in AI. So our clients, what they're looking for is, how can I apply AI? How can I use the data? They have a lot of data, they don't really know how to use it. How I can get the right resources to help me? And what we are telling them is, first ask yourself the questions of what you want to do with AI, but then I just talk about AI. And I think it's asking the questions, defining the problems you want to solve, and then use AI. That's the right way to do it, rather than, rather than pushing AI. And are they aware that it's important to adopt an ethical approach to it? I think they're all aware. I mean, you know, we're living in a world where with the 17 SDG, uh, at the World Economic Forum was a very important talk on the SDGs and, and this type of thing. So everyone is aware of this. Uh, everyone is also aware that AI is uh, impacting everything. And therefore, you cannot just mingle around. You have to think ethically. You have to think about sustainability. And you have to think how you're impacting the life of customers employees and citizens. And that's what AI for Good is about. Charles-Edouard thank you so much. Thank you.